Hey, this is Brian with worshiptutorials.com. I wanted to take a moment today and show you how to transfer pads to your iOS device, either an iPhone or a uh, iPad or maybe an iPod that you might be using uh, to play the pads that you have purchased from worshiptutorials.com. If you have purchased them, I thank you very much. I hope that they are working well for you uh, in your worship services, if that's what you're using them for, whatever you're using them for. So the first thing that you're going to need to do is download the pads. Now, uh, when you buy the pads, you will get an email that has all of the links to download the files. Uh, you can also come over here to the My Account page at worshiptutorials.com. If you chose to create an account, uh, you will have this option for you and then anything that you buy at worshiptutorials.com or anything we have some free products as well these two the chord number system and the capo cheat sheet are available for free uh, but anything that you purchase there um, will show up in your available downloads so the first thing you'll need to do is download the pads I think the easiest way to do it is to get this file that says all keys it's a zip archive file that contains all 12 of these keys. Alternatively, you can download each key individually if you'd like. But all you need to do, hit the link, it'll download, and you're off. So once the uh, file has downloaded, you uh, will extract that file, that archive file, and you will end up with a folder. Uh, and in that folder will be all of the pad key files. So uh, you have 12, one for each key. There they are. So the next thing to do to get them onto your iOS device is to get them into iTunes. This is just the way Apple makes this work. So that's what we have to do. So pull up iTunes, go to your music, and you'll want to create a new playlist. You hit this little plus icon down here and select playlist and call it pads or whatever you'd like to call it. I have created one right here called pads. It's empty. So all you have to do is drag these files from this folder into your pads playlist and uh, there they are. So now you have each pad. You can see they're each 20 minutes long. And uh, now we'll need to sync them to your phone or your iPod, iPad, whatever you have. So I have mine set up to wirelessly sync. Uh, you can also use the cable, plug it into the USB port on your computer. But go over to your phone or your iOS device, what have you. Go to the Music tab. And I have mine set so that I have to select this playlist. And when I do, it will add it. As you can see, it added it to uh, my phone to sync. Hit Apply. And off it goes. Syncing has to find your phone. And then it will transfer those files to your iPhone. Once you sync your iOS device and those files transfer, you will find them in the music app. So just open up the music app and uh, there they will be. And you can play them directly from that app. Uh, there are also other applications you can use to play those files. But you can play it from the music app if you'd like. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.